welcome, welcome back, back to my, my channel. channel. <laughs> Sorry, I just knew that you Yeah, just to psychic. Um, so this is currently future me um, because me went on to delete some footage from the camera yesterday because the memory card was full and I only bloody deleted the beginning of this vlog. So luckily it was just me talking and I didn't delete any of the um, sorting that I filmed. But hi, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all all right. Um, it was a Saturday, it's now Sunday, but yesterday I basically spoke about how um, Chai's been poorly. He's on antibiotics. On the clip, he was literally rolled up behind me on the sofa, feeling sorry for himself. And uh, whereas now, luckily, he's, at, he's on antibiotics and he is much more himself. And he's on chicken, rice, and scrambled eggs. And he's much more himself today, isn't he? He's been playing, he's stole my slipper. So really, he's on the mend. Um, although we have to cover his um, antibiotics and peanut butter because they're really big. Um, and he is not, not a fan. <laughs> not a fan. So peanut butter to the rescue. Um, but yeah, so basically in this vlog, yesterday I was saying how I'm getting in the Christmas spirit and how it's now officially, oh, you're not focused on me. Now, to me, it's officially Michael Bublé season. Well, first of November with Michael Bublé season. Yeah, exactly. I have been listening to him in the car, um, but we've we still had the autumn decks up. So I went around yesterday and sorted it all out, sorted the boxes out. Um, so you'll see me do that, which is always fun to watch organizing and stuff. And then I don't think I mentioned anything else. Um, I mentioned, Oh yeah, I mentioned about when are you putting your Christmas decks up? When when's your? Because I really want to. That's what we're doing today. I would like to, but the only thing is we have a real tree for the living room, so we obviously can't put that, put that up because for one we haven't got one, and two even if we did, it'd be dead by the time Christmas came. So we could put the decks up in the rest of the house and then just save the tree. I think so. The Christmas tree decoration bonanza. <laughs> That's what you should call it. Yeah. Um, but I'm not sure. Um, we'll, we'll I, see. I think it's very yeah. vile. Um, well, yeah. How many people that watch it and hear that and think the same thing? I think, you know, when you put your hob on it, it goes. Ours, ours, anyway. Mums don't. No, ours does it. I've heard it before, though, because I used to do it at Mum's house. I'm sure I did. Mm. And I like that song, so. Uh, but yes. Okay, I'm going to let you get back to current me. No. Past, past me. Um, where I'm sorting everything out. Um, and then you'll see this exact same clip in a second. Because it'll be me again. <laughs> when you get to it halfway through the vlog. It'll be me again right now. Current me. Um, but yeah, enjoy. It, I enjoyed doing it. I enjoyed sorting it. Um, that's his cough. Oh dear. Oh dear. He's coughing whilst watching Brad eat leftover takeaway, so. <laughs> right, okay, enjoy the vlog um, and thank you for being here. I really appreciate you. Um, and now to pass me. I will be sad to see these little pumpkins go. everything i've put the um tea towels and one of the hand towels in the washer i've got one clean one here um but i want to put them obviously away clean so that when i get them out next year it's just already done so i've got all of my easter things and spring things in this box um and it's just a bit pointless because it's hardly full um so i'm going to put move them over to this smaller one, put my Halloween decorations in this one and then my autumn ones in that. So, because I never get the Halloween decks out at the same time as the autumn ones as you already know. So, 
if they have their own box and I can leave the Halloween one up in the loft for a little bit longer. So I'm just gonna move all of the Easter things across Ross. So the who does that? That's the bunny that you like to keep stealing, child. My little signs. Fairy lights here. I don't know where I put fairy lights. The bunny ears and that. Okay, so that is Easter. Completely sorted. Okay, next one. I'm gonna put Halloween. Now, what did I do with all the Halloween decorations? Oh, I forgot to put the Halloween plate out. Halloween plate. So let's just do this. So in this one, this was the pumpkin decorations. So I'm going to put these in here. I know technically they don't need to be in a box, do they? But then there's part of me that's like, use the box, use the box. Do I? Yeah, I'll just keep on using the box just across. Helps to keep them extra clean. And also it's like exciting, like every year I forget what they look like. Then in this one, there was, I have no idea what was in this one. But then in this one, there was the little pumpkins. I remember that much. They definitely need to be in a box though because they break very easily. Like the little stem on them breaks really easy. So that's them ones. I don't know what was in this. I can't remember for the life of me. I am just going to dust these with this clean. Um, and then these can go at the bottom. Just that when I get them out next year. It's just one less job to do next year in it now. That fits in beautifully on that there. I'm just going to cover the top of them. Okay, so next. That can go there. For our fairy tale pumpkins. That can go there. And there. So this is a full candle, so that's going to stay. I'll light you down. This one is almost gone and burnt, so I'm going to just let it burn out tonight. This honey pumpkin one is the same. So we've just got that one. Oh, I actually forgot. There's one that rolled under the sofa the other day. Oh, yeah. There it is. <laughs> Try not to. <laughs> um, so then that can go in because I've not used that one either. I've not actually used candles that much. I have got a maple spice one there, which I got for autumn, but because it's like, I like it, the looks of it there. It smells really nice. It doesn't just smell like autumn so I'm going to keep that out. Then I've got my mushrooms. Oh, actually, a piece of this fell off the there. I just need to go and collect it. My little mushroom. I've only, mushroom, pumpkin. I've only got one of these left, haven't I, Chai? I wonder why. I wonder where the other one went. Put the glass. Then we've got two pillows. A tea towel, which I might just put in like that, just so it like helps protect if anything gets knocked. We've got one pillow, two pillow. I'll just set such bad fit. Um, I really don't know what was in this box. That's a real mystery. I'm just going to um, make some labels now. So even though you should be able to see Halloween, is that two hours? It has, hasn't it? Has it? Yes, I think. Halloween deck or Asians. Does it? Hey Siri. 
spell Halloween? Halloween. H. A. L. L. Yeah, I thought it did. That's oh. what I've done. Thank you. W e. So I've got Halloween decorations. So now I need autumn decks. Autumn decorations, print them out. I like to do two so I get one on each side of the box. So then if Brad goes up into the loft or me, it's just right there in plain sight. We can't miss. Right, and then let's go. Spring slash. Sepper ring slash um, Easter. So the labels are on that side and now I'm just going to repeat the process on the other side of the box. So then whenever they're in storage up in the loft, we can easily see what they are. So they are all put away. They're in there. I've just moved them upstairs. Wow, that was very overexposed. I've just moved them all upstairs, um, ready to put, what was that? Excuse me. Hey, no, we're not making holes in it. He's feeling, he must be feeling a little bit better because he's just stole my dressing gown. Um, but yeah, can you believe right now? So the camera is not really showing it justice because I've got the brightness up a little bit. Um, God, I'm very rosy cheeked right now. But it's actually, it looks way brighter on screen, but it's quite dark in here right now. And it's half past three. Like, it's so miserable. I've had to put the big light on in the kitchen because I, it feels about seven o'clock. Um, so I've put the big light on. I haven't eaten, so I'm gonna just put some, get some toast. Um, but I've got this new bread from Aldi. It says, I'm new. And it's extra thick, just like your ass. Um, and so I'm going to try it because I'm a, I love a good bit of toast. You can't beat a good piece of toast actually. Um, and you know when it's like, oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. Doorstop bread, that's what you want. I do anyway. I love a good doorstop bread. So I'm just going to put it on the grill. And then have a drink because I need to drink some fluids because I've had a chai latte and the leftover squash that was from last night. So I need to drink a bit of something. Because then I wonder like, why have, I, why have I got a little bit of a headache? And I'm like, well, drink something. Your body's screaming out. Toast ready, little lamp on. I'm just gonna sit and eat my toast and my squash and Brad should be back within the next half an hour so it'll be nice to see him. Um, I've got some like little sweet corny things as well instead of crisp. I love them. I thought that was him then. Um, why do I choose to chill when I'm mid-talking? Anyway, um, we watched that film with Harry Styles in it, Don't Worry Darling, last night. I've got mixed emotions about it. Have you watched it? I enjoyed it, but I feel like it took a while to get into it, I think. 
and then I won't spoil it if you haven't watched it but the ending for me is a bit cliffhanger -y, and that doesn't really give it away and I'm the kind of person that I need to know what's happened I need to know the next step I need to know the outcome what did you think to it if you've watched it and if you haven't I'd say watch it, but I wouldn't say you're going to be blown away. Maybe you will. Maybe I was just a harsh critique. But it was nice to see Harry, though. Very nice to see Harry, actually. <laughs> um, but, yeah, also, another question. Are you a triangle girl or boy? Toast. Ooh. Would you like square toast? Because I feel like square toast tastes different to triangle. I feel like triangle toast is so much better because you can just put it in perfectly this is what my life has come to <laughs> can you see that i've not spoke to another human actually now i have facetimed my sister today and i spoke to, um, spoke to brad before i went but i've not spoke to another human so my body i'm obviously like ramble like ask them how they like their co uh, their toast to be cut but valid questions i feel like it doesn't taste the same if you have square toast i'd eat it but i'll I prefer it to be triangle. I don't know. We're in um, PC World. Brad's looking for a TV screen or PC screen for his PlayStation, aren't you? Because we're having a game room upstairs. This is um, this is the film we've just watched. It was awful. I liked it, but it was, it was just it, it just. Was bad. And just like that. <laughs> is that what I was going to say? Yeah, I bet it were. And just like that, we've left Curry's PC world. <laughs> I definitely wasn't going to say interesting. You like were. So, so, we're just um, on our way out and then we're going to nip into Sainsbury's because I've got a order to pick up from the Argos that's in there. And then we can have a look around as well, just at the homeware bit, just because um, I love Sainsbury's homeware bit because it's just so nice. I love Sainos. Sainos. Never called it that. No, I ain't either. Why did you? No, it's Jess. Jess calls it Sainos. Uh, yeah, our friends call it Sainos. And just like that. <laughs> and just like that, we're so doing it. Back in the car. Back in the way back from Sainos. <laughs> We've got some different chocolates to try. It's a Cadbury's Caramel Biscuit, was it? Oh, you're close. What were it? Cadbury's Peanut Caramel Biscuit. I'm probably going to get copyrighted for that. Start that. again. And just like that. We're back in the his house, I in the Audi the Gaudi. Yeah, we were listening to um, ABBA. Is that what ABBA, is that ABBA, yeah? Yeah, Mamma Mia. I'm sure it is, isn't it? ABBA? Oh, fucking hell, baby. Yeah, feel the love, like um, Yeah, we're listening to Mamma Mia. The winner takes it all. Um, but yeah, we're on our way back home now to Chai Pai. He's been on his own for an hour. Yeah, just over an hour. Just over an hour. We put him... Um, made his, his crate all we'll comfortable. We'll put him his armbands on. Put his crate all comfortable. Um, but now we're going to get back. And then the blanket's got to be in... Oh, I hope it's not. No, in tatters. I, I hope it's not. It's going to rip it apart. He probably will have an off. Have you seen my dressing gown? No. He I loves to rip clothes and pants and it's his back teeth. God, will you go study? You're making me feel sick. Oh. You got something on your nose. <laughs> You got something on your nose. Um, so I shot. I thought I'd show you what we got. So it was the peanut caramel crisp, not biscuit crisp. Um, three, like to go on presents. That's the picture frame, and then these are the wallpapers. Not wallpapers, wrapping papers. Then Brad got a new game and um, TV screen. That's TV screen. TV screen. Just TV. Just TV. Oh yeah. And that's down there. Um, so yeah, successful mini shopping trip. We could always set up my PlayStation stuff. Like has this an update for one of the bedrooms. <laughs> you want to show your updated PlayStation section? Yes. Okay, we can show that. I know also he's had a shave and just got a tash left, but I think he looks like a different person with our beard, and I'm not gonna lie. I prefer him with a beard. <laughs> I like you with the tash though. But I am. Um, I'm a beard girl. 
He just stuffed his nose somewhere. Right up your butt. Yep. So, welcome to time for Tink. This is not Tink. This is Brad's version of ASMR. One. Is it like like a Reese's Pieces? Like a Snickers. What do you think of it? One lick for good? Well done, he likes it. Mummy's turn. Ready for the crunch? Jaw crunch. Like Snickers. Just like Reese's Pieces. Brad wants to show you his setup um, for his new um, screen that he's got. And the setup is complete. Um, obviously, it's not fully 100%. You you want to add things to in here, don't you? Yeah, um, I don't think so. I mean, maybe one thing, but. But for now, yeah. it's looking brilliant. It's just got um, nine hours to update because <laughs> this is his new game. But that's on the wall now, which looks really cool. It doesn't show you really on camera what it looks like. Um, but you're content, aren't you? Are you happy? Just looking forward to playing on it. Good morning. It's a new day. And I just recorded a clip of me in this position for the beginning of the vlog because me being me deleted it, didn't I? Um, but yes, Almost good morning. Me. No, you was distracting me, so technically I did it. I, I pressed the button, so. I won't distract, I'm just talking to you. Yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, Chai's just, we're just doing Chai's breakfast now. Um, he's having scrambled egg, chicken and rice with some antibiotics on the side. Well, he's having scrambled egg with goat's milk. What yeah. What are you doing on that? I don't mind, but you've got to mix it up all together anyway. Yeah, just goat's milk, scrambled egg. So today's plans. I want to sort out the earring cupboard because I enjoy when it looks neater. neater and I enjoy when it, I like to buy like, so body washers, I won't just buy like one from the shop, I like to order like 10, 11 and then we've got them in there so then we never run out, so then when we get, yeah so that no, we don't need like one a month, but you definitely get through more than one a month. I don't use it. Either. They're not that big are they? They're not the biggest bottles, but I like to have them on hand so that we never run out. And then when I get to about two, I can think, oh, I'll order some more. Whereas I know that if I did it, like, if I got a bottle every time I went actual shopping, I could forget. And I don't know. Just bin bags. Just bin bags. I forgot. I forgot bin bags for like. Last four weeks. No, I didn't. I forgot them last week. And then we went a week without a bin bag. So guys, Birthday. I did have one, but um, this right. is a yeah. This is a bigger banner boy. Bigger banner boy. Bigger banner boy. I got a dehydrator. Um. So oranges. I've been wanting to do it. I wanted to do it last Christmas. <laughs> I wanted to do it last Christmas to make um 
Last year, I wanted to do um, a wreath, not a wreath, um, a garland. Brad's behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> you know I mean? Honestly, I'm going to lose the plot with you. <laughs> Brad's chai is coughing at you, I tell you. So you leave my mummy alone. Did I? I want a fucking chocolate. Right. Third time lucky. Yeah? You can just leave it. We can explore it together in a minute. Yeah. Last year I really wanted to do um, some orange, like an orange garland. Thing. <laughs> 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 I saw you smirk. Oh, <laughs> You're trying to sabotage something. Huh? I don't know what your next plan is. You're unpredictable. Hey. But whatever it is, Please let me just talk about these bloody oranges. This has been filming for two and a half minutes and it's well, literally you, just... You've not said nothing. No, because you... I've not done nothing. <laughs> because I've you. Just what? <laughs> okay. Take 5,000. So... Take one. Take one. I've been wanting to do an orange garland, I think it's called. Do you know the thing that I've got in the window at the minute? Oh, that's one thing I've not took down for autumn. It's still in the window. I need to take that down. But yeah, one of them where there's like pumpkins and leaves. I think I'd like to do one of them, possibly there with oranges, or maybe something to go around the tree. I don't know. I just really want to do some dehydrated oranges, and you can buy them. But where's the fun in that? So for my birthday, I did have a dehydrator before, but for my birthday, I've had, I've been given, um, a, given a, what's it called, a dehydrator. Oh my god, I can't even get the word out. In this Cook's Professional one, let's have a look. Look at orange, orange peel. Eight to sixteen hours. That was, yeah. That's orange, orange peel, though. Orange peel. Yeah, what orange peel? Yeah, but orange peel is included in this. Yeah, but it's not going to take sixteen hours to dehydrate the orange inside. What do you think? How um, about yeah, that? Yeah, you want to like whip your little finger, remember it's smaller. Yeah. That's it. Though. Yeah. That looks like a good slice. Good yeah. cross section. That's a good slice. Wow. That's like a tropicana advert. To like 50 or something. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. And then we'll just leave it. I completely forgot about this guy. It's such a nice day today. The sun is gorgeous. Yesterday, it was so grey and miserable. Um, but I'm going to show you. Yesterday, the postman came and delivered this. Um, so I think it's so cute, so I thought I'd show you. It's a print that says, Farm fresh um, Christmas trees, freshly cut pine, spruce and fir. And I'm going to put that in a frame. You know the ones that I had for the... Um, let's get cosy and the pumpkin ones and I'm going to get some different frames because I've shoved them frames obviously up in the boxes because I want to be able to just grab them out ready each year I don't want to have to change over the frame so I'm going to order some frames possibly the same possibly different I'm not really sure what kind of style I want to go for for the Christmas themes um, but I need to have a look at some picture frames so that I can put, because I've, I've ordered this one, I ordered another A4 one and then there's an A3 one coming, which I'm really excited for because it's like subtle Christmas decorations, like we've got Christmas decks but without the glitter and 
Do you know what I mean? Like, it's just subtly Christmas and it just adds that bit of coziness. That's what I think anyway. He's watching the world go by. He loves these windows. Although, my windows don't love him because that window looks filthy chai. So I'm going to clean that right now while I think about it. Because that looks minging. It's got your nose all over it. Yeah, I'm going to clean them. You used to fit into that. It fits, mommy. So this is where it used to go. And this is where it now goes. <laughs> Look at his face. So <laughs> what? What's your? Don't stop at my accord. Go on. No. <laughs> I'm camera shy. <laughs> yeah, you definitely know. I have to see. It was just singing, have a holly, jolly Christmas. Yeah, it sounded better than that, though. Yeah, it did sound better than that. I'm joking, I can't sing it, you're the singer, dude. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, you're the singer, dude. We're eh? just on the way to oh, oh, the range. <laughs> the range, because I've seen that they do. Don't be a prat. There was a speed up. Um, yeah, I've seen that they do green baubles and that's what colour we're going to go for in the kitchen. We went for this blue last year that you really liked, didn't you? Yeah. And it did look nice, but it's we've got a green kitchen now especially as well. I know it doesn't really matter too much, but it's, it what, wasn't really my favourite colour, I'm not going to lie. What's saying? Blue and green should never be seen except upon a fool. Except upon a what? A fool. A fool? Blue and green should never be seen except upon a fool. I don't know. Sure, I have no idea. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've seen green baubles and also just to see what the Christmas decks they've got. Um, and then have a look around. We need to get some cheap cushions because we need the fluff from inside the cheap cushions to put in. Um, God, I feel like I'm on a race car. <laughs> Even though you're not speeding. I'm not. It's <laughs> okay. just fluid. Yeah, it was, felt, felt a bit like woo, woo. It's fluid. That's what um, it is. Yeah, what I was saying. For the um, foot stool, we need some of like the stuff that's inside the inner of a cushion. The stuffing. Um, and it might work out cheaper just to buy some pillow pillows. Actually, like some one pound pillows. Or yeah, but I looked pillows. in um, Dunham. They're all a fiver. The cheapest one they've got is a fiver. Oh, IKEA. No, they're not that cheap. They're feathers and all. I think. IKEA. They're wonderful, I think it's going here. Um, so yeah, so we need to get some, see what if they've got any cheap pillows. Um, and then look at decks and just have a walk around because everyone loves to walk around the range. Well, I do anyway. Find out what hobby I can pick up next. I'm thinking stained glass. <laughs> stained glass or pottery. I've not yet decided. <laughs> Where would we put them? Around my telly. Oh, around your telly. Oh, cute. Making yeah. the office look cute. So they can get washed. Yeah. We're back and I thought I'd show you what we got. So, we got just this blanket. This is um, white with a little bit of gold. It's quite subtle. I just love that it's not like in your face trees. Um, then Brad loved this star for the tree and we needed a new star for the tree. So, there's that. And we've got this countdown, which I thought was super cute. Or oh, shows you the date. Then these aren't really showing up the colour as well as they actually are in real life. But they have got, oh wait, slightly. They've got a little bit of green on them. And then we saw this one, which I think is super cute. Then picked up a couple of bin buddies. And what flavours did you get? Rhubarb and pink grapefruit. Then we got one of these, because I thought, how cute would it be if we put a picture of Chai in it on Christmas Day? I'm and I'll write on the back of it 2022 so we know. I've just been crispated. Oh my god. <laughs> He's like, no, no, that's mine, Daddy. <laughs> and then we got this. Oh my gosh. Oh, I didn't even show you. So it lights up and it's got glitter. And I know it's, it's old fashioned, but I love that. I love that it's old fashioned. And, and another old fashioned thing that we got was this Santa. 
so yeah it is old fashioned but it makes me think of my childhood Christmas decorations and that makes me feel all like warm inside and then I went across to Matalan and I got a new one of these biscuit tins because Chai when, when he's been out in, of the crate in the kitchen on his own he somehow managed to get the lid off and then chewed it and now it doesn't fit properly and then these which were on, on offer they were £4.50 but they were £2.50 so I got two of them because I thought they're really nice aren't they that different and then the last thing we got was a new mat because I don't know if I've told you but the reason Chai's back in the crate is because he's destroyed a bit of the floor another one of the prints that I ordered has come driving home for Christmas yeah, look how cute that is. I just need to get frames now. We're gonna put the autumn, Halloween, and the spring decks up, and we're gonna get the Christmas down. So we're not gonna decorate, but we're gonna get them down ready. Oh, you should see the dead cork in the thing that's here. I've put the decks all in the spare room, um, ready to go. But I can't believe we've got this much in, we've only had one Christmas here. That's actually ridiculous, isn't it? And I literally just said to Brad, I was like, we're gonna need another box. Uh, I, was, it, I was right when I said last year, I was like, we're gonna have a box every year. And then I said to Brad, when we was in the range, and I was like, come 10 years, it'll be the grotto. So I'm going to move on to the earring cupboard now and sort through it a little bit. So it's not too bad, don't get me wrong. There's just some bags that if we ever go weekends away or anything like that, we just shove them there. The ironing board that I've never once used and the iron that I've never once used either. And then we've got some clean bed sheets, more clean bed sheets, towels, face cloths and then more clean bed sheets. And then down here, we've got my basket of everything that we use um, so I'm just gonna get them out and tidy them up and make it look aesthetically pleasing. In here we've got all of the sun cream, sanitary products. Um, I, lo I like this body wash just because it's sensitive. And then we've got some spray shampoo, toothpaste, hand soaps, uh, razor blades, toothbrushes, um, and then a little bit of bleach for the toilets and then loads of face wipes. Oh, what's that? Hand sanitizer. So, I'm going to sort through. What's that? Another toothbrush. And get organised in a spit razor. And it's sorted. So, it looks a little bit neater. So, that's a little bit of an all sorts. It's got sun cream, hand soap, just a bit of everything. But then this one is the one that's like nice to grab from. We've got toothpaste, toothbrushes, body wash, shampoo and conditioner, face wipes. And then below it, we've got toilet roll. And then the iron's now in that basket. We've left the bags there just so they're easy to grab. And the ironing board is still here. Got some bath salts. All of the bedding's on here, except for the spare room bedding's up there. And then towels but a lot of them in the wash right now so they will be going in there tonight when everything's clean and dried but yeah happy with that i'm happy i've done that i'm just gonna go and wrap a few christmas presents just to get on top of it so that i haven't got loads to wrap all in one go i can just do it bit by bit no stress then and then everything's organized and ready to go let's go and tweak mommy let's go see what she wants what did you say babe did you away? no what did you want I'm just sat editing this vlog and I realised that I didn't actually end it or finish or say bye. So I'm jumping in here with my beautiful fresh faced, um, bare face to say thank you for being here. Oh and there's my alarm. 
thank you for being here thank you for supporting me and um, please subscribe if you aren't already um and yeah i hope you're happy and healthy because you deserve to be um and i hope you have a beautiful week and i shall see you next tuesday bye